the most powerful example of static electricity is lightning. The rapid motion of molecules and thunderclouds causes the formation of pockets of either negatively or positively charged particles. As these areas of opposite ion concentration become larger and larger, the attraction between the two areas increases. Eventually, a sudden burst of static discharge jumps from one of these areas to the other. These static discharges, called lightning, can take place between clouds, within clouds, or can strike the Earth. Lightning is a destructive and dangerous phenomenon, which is responsible for starting thousands of forest fires, hundreds of building fires, along with killing approximately 100 people every year in the U.S. as the result of direct strikes. Lightning rods are attached to tall buildings and other structures that are susceptible to lightning strikes in order to prevent damage. Motion between two objects in contact can cause one object to lose electrons, while the other object gains them. If we brush our hair rapidly, our hair gives up electrons to the brush. Our hair then becomes attracted to the brush as they now possess an opposite electrical charge. The amount of electric charge an object has is measured in coulombs. The unit is named in honor of the French scientist Charles Coulomb. Coulomb was one of the first scientists to investigate the forces caused by static electricity. One coulomb is defined as the electric charge of 6.25 multiplied by 10 to the 18th electrons or protons. An object that gains 6.25 by 10 to the 18th electrons has a static charge of one coulomb. The object that gave up the electrons also has a charge of one coulomb because it now has the same amount of excess protons.